today I have with me Cody. He is a one-year-old golden retriever. As you can see, he's a little bit timid. Um, he needs a little bit help in the socialization aspect. His parents also said that he likes to chew on everything. He likes to jump on their family. Um, they did say they worked on a little bit at home, so let's see what he knew. Cody, can you come? Come on! Wow, sick good boy. Oh, we can't hold it though. That's okay. What about down? Can we down? <gasps> down? Oh, it was like a hop up down. That's okay. That's okay. We can work on it. Okay, let's go for a walk. Okay, let's go for a walk. Here you go. 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 No. Okay. <laughs> he wants to go wherever he wants to go with that heel, but that's okay. We'll work on all his problems while he's here with us for those 15 days. So keep up with his progress as well as all the other pups we have right now on our social media. Thank you. 
So my name is Marta, Marta Garza, and this is Cody. We call him our boy. The reason I brought him here, well, it was a big research that we did where to take him. Um, our kids already out of the house, and this is so. This is like it is like the boy that he stayed, and we started all over again. So we were looking for. I guess we got him way too spoiled, where we didn't really know how to teach him, how to sit, how to stay, and it became a big problem. My husband and I would love to travel, and the barking, he saw a dog, and every time he sees, he used to see a dog, was a big problem. Like, he wanted to eat it. I mean, it was, Sometimes a lot of embarrassment is very stressful for me and my husband that a lot of times we had to leave places for that. Not only that, also when we walk, it was like he was just pulling us, my arms, everything. It was, we could not have any control of him. Uh, he ate our antique furniture. He damaged our front doors. It was becoming to be a little bit of a nightmare what we thought it was going to be something so nice so my daughter just started googling and googling and googling will be the, the best place to take him and after a lot of long research and visiting different places thank god and i really thank god that we found this place oh my gosh today it's been two weeks and today I'm bringing, I'm taking, finally, I'm taking him home. And actually we brought his sister that she's gonna stay another week. Uh, and I'm sure she's gonna turn out exactly so great as him. Today, I'm gonna to say that he's actually graduating. I did all the commands and everything. And I really thought that it could not happen. And it does. And you can come and bring your dog and, and have a happy life because that's what they bring happiness to us so i really wanted to thank ashley oh my god this girl is awesome um her attitude her love towards dogs is what gave us the confidence of leaving our member of our family here a place that we didn't know a place that we really did not know anybody but when we dropped him off, she gave us so much confidence that he was going to be in good hands and the turnout was amazing. Um, so really, thank you, Ashley, for everything you have done. Thank you so much, sweetie.